a new episode. Isn't that bad? Ooh, what's going on here? G? I guess they're leaving. Yeah, yeah, they are. Because that was the last thing I did last time. Okay. So I nearly forgot to record this week. I did uh, Minecraft, but then that was Sunday. We were kind of busy Saturday doing other things. And I didn't do my normal recording. Let us review briefly. Can an enemy get in from over here? Maybe. <sighs> Seems like all the enemies can swim uh, easily, whereas I can never swim. So let's just assume. And then, of course, this turns to ice sometimes. However, that said, I have a gate, a grate, but not a grate. What am I saying? A... Okay, there is a mechanism, so that's good. I don't. I just don't know why there's a spare mechanisms in here. Um, oh. How's this coming along? Not very well. Hey, look, there's a hole in the floor. What's that all about? Um, hey, that's my voice. Um, anybody can get in through this way. But, and there aren't any traps yet. Oh, but actually there are. There, the traps are here. So unfortunately, this does nothing to protect. This really is kind of a pointless thing. I, all I can do really is drop some uh, enemies by surprise a whole sprain their ankle distance but then again there are traps on the underside so that's something um, uh, so I'm gonna have to be pretty good at climbing to get up here but there are some that are so there's that flying is an issue going all the way up here ooh, 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 ooh. that's something I wanted to do was uh, keep this going what have I been using so far Diorite. Okay, I'm pretty sure I just used some diorite a minute ago. Did I not? Di Ooh, diorite 13. Okay, that's the issue. I'm waiting for more. Hmm. Hey, look at that. There's a giant hamster in the tree. That's really interesting, actually. Hmm. Mechanisms, mechanisms, that looks good. I have long since forgotten what the, which one they're attached to. Let's pull some levers and find out at random. What else is going on? Sorry, it's been a while. I need to catch up. I've got all these guys, but I don't seem to be trying to trade with them. I think they're, le I've, like I said, I think they've gone. Uh, dig. Oh, yeah. This I forget. What is this going to be? These are going to be some sort of high-end quarters, obviously. Uh, I just don't remember which. Who do I have now? I have a mayor, do I not? Whoops. A baron! Yes, Fangs is a baron. That's right. Okay, well, I think I'm caught up, so let me do a little bit and then get back to you. Looky! Whoops. Pause, resume, pause, resume. I have new rooms going in. Uh, they're still very slow to produce any kind of green glass, and I should probably stop making my chair make quite so much noise. But hey, look, rooms! There are even people living in them, and strangely, a lot of these rooms are with couples, like this. Look at that. Well, not him. I think there was more over here. Fish, suturers, brewer and potash maker. Very, very good. Uh, the bridge is starting to come together. They're very, again, slow to dismantle things. I think my arrangement of skills um, should be better. And you notice, uh, somebody early on warned me this could get a little slow with the ocean here, and that's turning out to be true. Though, it hasn't really bothered me in the past, because this is still an acceptable speed, and I don't think my, my dwarven population tap is not really going to get any higher than this, except for children, so... This should be pretty good until, like, like a massive army or something shows up. Ooh, look, that's done. Let me take that out. Ah, <sighs> yep. Oh, no, he has the birth. Where'd you go? Is that it right there? Ustuth Mobinzl. Was it Kedal? No, no, Momus Evuk. How, how far away could have you gotten, Momus? No, seriously, what? How'd you escape? Oi. Okay, so wait a minute. Mumu's Evu... Evu's? Mumu's Evu's. How do I find you? Uh, there should be a search thing here. 
remove worker. What's it? Momus. Momus. Avus. Momus. Avus. Momus. Avus. Sounds start starting to sound like a French song. Momus. Avus. Momus. Avus. There we go. Oibalist. Where you be, Oibalist? Okay. So let's take a look at this baby. V. We need to study. There it is. Magada. Daughter of Momus Mine Swelters and Tun or Tun Roby Scrapes. Uh, Ruby Scrapes. What am I saying? Roby. She is the worshipper of Lorbum. Citizen of the flag. Sounds American. Uh, was born today. Straight hair. Extremely sparse. Incredibly tough. Like Sylvite. Good choice. Bronze. Rhodolite. Good choice. Alder. Wood. Deer leather, knaf, plant fiber, fabric, the color gold, picks, shields, and pigs for their sense of smell. Thornback ray, white millet beer, refined tastes for a one day old, honey beef honey, absolutely detest mosquitoes as do we all. Let's see. Personally sees comp competition as wasteful and silly. Hey, me too. Finds blind honestly, on blind honesty foolish, that I don't agree with, and does really doesn't really value merrymaking. I don't either. So two out of three isn't bad. Dreams of creating a great work of art. I guess. Dig, 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 dig. Oh look, Ineth Shaludustuth has given boyth. There should be like prohibition within the military fraternization until they retire. You know something. Oh, because this just never works out well. Let's see what we have, though. Dadaga, she is the daughter of Ineth Clutch Fence and Gear Muscle Lash. Sounds painful. Casual Worship of Rain, Sapphire Silver, the Zircon Pearl. Every one of those is like <laughs> a mineral. Um, and a casual uh, worshiper of Futha Viper Lilac. That sounds rather dangerous, too. Born today, clean shaven, slightly thin irised cobalt eyes. Urgh, cobalt. Likes lead, cryolite, melanite, two hump camel bone, maces, and bogeymen for their terror inspiring antics. <laughs> nice. When possible, prefers to consume Oriole, as do we all. And custard apple cider. She absolutely detests whims. Uh, amazing spatial sense, national inclination toward language, and a sum of patience. Personally finds the ideas of independence and freedom somewhat foolish and doesn't think one way or another about leisure time. Dreams of yet another great work of art. So I'm starting to build some outer walls. Uh, this, I think, will designate an area that attaches to the rest and in which, in which there's sort of more randomized inner town. Though considering how much la ma ugh, map will be left, there might not be much of an outer town. But at least, is this one? No. Um, at least there'll be like a facilities. Let's see, two, two. Whoops, no, not basalt. This city is obsidian only. We must have the most spectacular. Whoops. Gosh, I'm just making all kinds of mistakes, folks. Uh, let's see. I can do this, I swear. Ooh, excuse me. Well, project, pro, pro, blah, 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 project, progress is slow. The outer wall's coming out. Let's see, let's shrink our map. There. It's starting to curve back outwards again after that neck area. Uh, I'm liking this so far. I don't know much more than that, but hopefully that area will be completely enclosed at some point soon. Protect all the dwarves who live inside. Well, winter came on rather suddenly. Still raining, and yet frozen ocean. Well, except for over here. The praise of sandals. It's not particularly descriptive. Engraved on the wall is a superiorly designed image of Vabok Platinum painted the dwarf and Lore Glen Boulder, which is a good name actually. Uh, the dwarf by Kedal Iklist Safir. Vibak is making a plaintive gesture. Lord Glen Lord <clears throat> is striking a menacing pose. Arc relates to the mortal wounding of the dwarf Vibok, platinum painted by the dwarf Lore. 
with a copper battle axe in the sea city in midsummer of the four of 449 um i don't really mortal wounding Pretty sure one of these belonged to him. There we go. Vebach, Pliat Luagemo. Oh, was that because uh, he couldn't do? Um, he couldn't finish his construction. That's what happened. He went insane. Okay. By the way, that <clears throat> that engraving was um, here on one of the posts in what is the hall just outside the offices and quarters of the Baroness. She actually now has a dining room. Doesn't count for much, as you can see. Oh, wait, she has kills. Oh, interesting. A hunter or some such. Make menacing spikes. I think I can do that. Uh, copper spike two. She asked for one, I'll make two. Hopefully that will get done sooner rather than later. Oh no, a possession Carol Beckharkas call is possessed, which means they don't get any credit. I hate that, when they don't get any credit. Let's see, I don't know. It's a whole other night now. It is Wednesday night. I started recording, I think, Monday night. And then I went and finished Final Fantasy XII on Tuesday night. I kind of got, oh, impatient. You know, there was probably another hundred hours worth of content I could have gone through. Oh, by the way, I have a lot more traps up at the front now. I'm making the enemies run a checkerboard of solid walls and traps to get through it. But yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I went and finished. Ooh! Crafts warp. Well, I guess if they're going to be possessed, it might as well be something like that. But yeah, what with me having to go to the NSF National Science Foundation for the weekly meetup, uh, civic hacking stuff at the NSF. Uh, this is my last chance to record before Friday. And what? what oh, that's the lack of snow because of the bridge up, up, ahead, up ahead. Up above, what am I saying? These need to go. I'm not sure if this bridge even needs a drop away. What it, it might need if I cut this, you know, like down here somewhere. Maybe this is the bottom. Right here or something I don't know otherwise what's the point they can just get there any way they want let's see basalt a lot quite a lot of stuff basalt table tut table cut cherry opal silver bars sheep leather silk cloth tanzanites zircons and yak leather carol beckarkeskal surgeon has created tarmid othat othat a basalt crown hit it best. It'd be nice if they'd actually use the things. Let's see. Yes, uh, are you familiar with the entire list? We got bracelet, hatch cover might be useful, earring, figurine, harp, statue. That's actually very useful, but I think it's already placed. An axe, which is neat. Uh, schist what? It's <laughs> not enough room to tell. Let's see. Seventy-eight thousand sounds pretty good. Basalt crown, craft worship is of the highest quality, encrusted with pear cut red zircons, decorated with yak leather and encircled with bands of cushion basalt cabochons. This uh, object is adorned with hanging rings of cherry opal and tanzanite and menaced with spikes of silver. Cape spider silk on the item is an image of mountain and sheep leather. Alright, let's take a look. Curvature is pretty interesting. What I need though, I'm gonna have to do soon, is. I'm gonna somehow I'm gonna have to. I made a bit of an overlap problem here. I, you know I should test them to see if my audio is actually recording correctly. This part here is wrong. I'm fixing it. But that was three. That was four. I mean the next two are three each. It's kind of nice when it just sort of automatically skirts around these uh, trees like it does. That's always nice. But I'm almost thinking having a couple of wings out to the sides. And then they suddenly shoot back. That's my thought for the moment. I should probably cut and put in a foundation underneath it. Oh look, I have to make a repair. I made, I did all the math wrong. This over here is supposed to, cat, seriously. 
Uh, this was supposed to be five long and then six, and so it's off a whole segment. <gasps> progress. Oops, I gotta unpause. Is progress. Put in more obsidian blocks right here. And tear down this damn tree which is in the way. Oh, damn. Uh, but that will be a tower on the corner there. I have to find the same place over here, though. Ooh, why is that suspended? Giant mosquito? Hmm. Woo Got more green glass to play with. This floor is coming out nicely. Most of these are ascribed rooms already. Just a couple that are not, like this one here. But I want to leave a couple open just so that people can take random naps as well. Gosh, when is it, how long is it going to take them to take these dang things out? Making blocks seems to be a higher priority for these folk. Let's see. How's this coming along? Oh, good, it's coming. Whoop, whoop, spring! New Year 452! And look, they actually tore out one of the uh, scaffolding thingies. It's amazing. They're making so much progress up there. Oh my god. Let's see. Uh, nothing else to report, I don't think. We... This is coming along. Oh, uh, except for suspended stuff. What's going on here? Why is so much suspended? And now I can finally put up these walls. I do have to make sure that the central pieces are done last, otherwise they'll fall to the ground and cause incidents. Woohoo! The spring caravan Lassi Fatira has come. I forgot where they go. Let's see. Can they still get there? Yes, they can. Okay. That's kind of a good thing. Now, what have I got? Oh, giant badger meat. Uh, I'm not sure if they'd appreciate meat. Uh, fruit and nuts. That's kind of cool. Garden vegetables, seeds, weapons. What have we got? Hmm. Not sure I want to give those up. Ooh, persimmon wood bolts, they'll love that. Do I have anything? Uh, gems. Sounds like lots of gems. Very good. Uh, some box shields. Interesting. Powders, mill pot. What have we got? Oh, this should be more, but we'll, I'll keep it for now. Dwarven syrup barrel, they will not appreciate that. Crafts, yes. Instruments, tools. That should be good. Oh, let's see. Black. Oh, I forgot. Okay, so cabochons. Dump, dump, dump. Don't sell any roughs. I want to keep those for the future round. This is quite hard to read, actually. Rose cut, blah, blah, blah. Mm, yes, I often get rid of all this stuff. <laughs> oh man, I haven't made any new music again this week. This is sucking it up. Large Levin Opal. Woo, that's expensive Goshenite. I can't even remember off the top of my head what Goshenite is like. I think it's a it's a garnet. I think it's a garnet. Let's see. Let's uh pull it back in. Totems. Oh. Large Jasper Opal. Ooh, should I keep the goblets? Large Black Zircon. Ooh, Totems. Lots of goblets. Who's who is it? The, these are the elves. They aren't the ones who asked for goblets. It was the uh, the the dwarves. They said they wanted goblets in particular. Oh my gosh, I have a lot of stuff. Wow. I wonder if exporting some of this junk off-site will help speed up the frame rate just a little bit. Wow, wow, wow. Yes, I know I'm giving them way more than they deserve. Filthy elves is. I, uh, there's a Dwarf Fortress group on the Facebook that I have joined, and they seem to be particularly bloodthirsty when it comes to elves. Is this normal for the Dwarf Fortress community to disdain them so much? Snowy Owl, Opossum, Green Tree Frog, Wolverine. That sounds interesting. Uh, mm, giant Wren. Don't care that much. Bushmaster. Hmm. That's a snake, is it not? I think Bushmaster is a snake. Let's take a look. Uh, Boozard. Cavisau. Giant Koati. Anything giant sounds cool. Lorikeet. Still quite hard to read. I don't need barrels or buckets at the moment. Yes, look at that. 12,000 profit for them. 
I'm alright making other people happy, that's fine. Uh, wow, they don't have much that I want, really. Not yet, anyways. Dip, 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 dip. Dip, 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 holy cow. Down in the arrows now. Seems like I missed all the. Wow, I don't know. It seems like there's a whole section of stuff they normally have that was missing. This stuff here, though, this will be awesome. I love this stuff. Make all kinds of funky meals and drinks with that. Really? That's all they got? Whew. I should probably cut back on the things I'm offering them. Let's uh, do that by... Turning off the whole bin. There you go. That's a big difference. I'm good giving them the rest. I mean, a nice fat profit margin ain't that. Actually, you know what? There. So that's pretty good. Um, hopefully there isn't any wood in here. Uh, trade. Thank you! And everything can go back. Excellent. So let's take a quick review. I'm still trying to build this. There's lots of fallen wood that's obscuring me finishing that down there. This thing's coming in over here. But, um... I think I'm pretty... Let's see, BCX... Marble 3. Yeah, see, I'm a bit low on the stuff I need to make those with. I may have to request the dwarves only work with marble and quartzite, as I know there is quite a bit down there. It's just they don't seem to be using it directly. Anything else? Actually, let's zoom out. Let's zoom out. So there's the entry. There's, there's the uh, aquifer way the heck over there. Let's see, there's my aquifer, the one I made myself. There's some gardens, along with... Uh, ooh, I forgot about all that up there. I don't think you can see my cursor, but... Uh, here's the Hall of Masons down here. And then there are a couple of pits um, where refuse is stored. But not, not like gross refuse, but useful refuse. As you can see, they're still, still uh, smoothing the rooms. But this up here is the barren stuff. So you've got offices... Dining rooms, a bedroom, and um, just uh, below it is their crypt, which actually you might be a little hard to see. There are fortifications, so basically there's slots to the thing, so pe commoners can view the crypt without being able to go in. Let's see what else. There's not much else going on down there. So you got these rooms, and then the mines. Pretty good. Still haven't found any, and I haven't been looking actually, haven't been looking for any um, things downstairs just yet. Caverns, that's what I'm thinking of. But there it is, there's the outer curvature, which I'm reasonably happy with. What I'll have to do eventually is fill that up with houses, and these can be slightly random, I think. Maybe, maybe not. We'll find out, as opposed to symmetrical. There may even be some outside the walls. But we'll, we'll decide about that much later. Right now, this finishing this fortification is going to be hard enough before I get attacked by anything. Ah, so there it is. There it is. I think that can conclude the week, do you not? If that's the case, uh, if you're watching this Friday night, what the hell's wrong with you? Uh, please. Uh, but otherwise, thanks. And uh, see you next week. Yeah.